following Nigeria's epileptic power supply over the years. The country's quest for renewable energy sources is increasing by the day. One of the major players in the renewable energy sector, Energy, has announced a breakthrough in raising $9 million in a Series A round of funding led by Breakthrough Energy Ventures with participation from the Norwegian Investment Fund for Developing Countries. According to energy founder and CEO Femi Adeyemo, while speaking at a press conference held in Lagos, the company is excited to enter into its next phase in development and investors that share its vision of tackling the most pressing energy challenges. Adeyemo says the company is now better positioned to roll out more affordable solar energy devices in 2019. Based on data that we gathered, customers are able to save between 20 to 25 percent on the current monthly expense as benchmarked against the diesel generators. So it is affordable, and I mean we've seen, for instance, in the healthcare sector in Lagos, we have a pharmaceutical uh, chain that they, we have three of their output power. They deploy the first one, and over three months, it was a no-brainer for them to come back to us to deploy more locations. We've done hospitals, we've done uh, hotels in Lagos. Uh, there is an hospitality client uh, out of Obali in the, that uh, is being an assistant. The first outlet is 18 months now. After the first four months, the provider called call us back, the principal called us back, and two other hotels he, uh, he subscribed for. And we got information from this same hotel that because they switched to our system, they are now seeing 600% increase in profitability on a monthly basis. Energy's distributed renewable energy systems harness the combination of solar power, superior storage solutions, and proprietary remote management technologies to deliver scalable, reliable, and affordable energy solutions that are tailored to tackle issues related to intermittency and grid unreliability. Since launch, Energy has delivered installed capacity and storage capacity to business and residential clients across Nigeria. The Energy founder also revealed the company's plan to enhance energy supply to health and hospitality facilities. So we will be looking to your support to be able to power the um, the, the clinics, the hospitals, the pharmacy outlets, because we know that if we're able to do that successfully, we will impact life directly. Education is very critical to us. If you know any schools that are still running on diesel generator, please feel free to refer them to us. Um, hospitality, Nigerians are no longer taking vacations in Nigeria because they're, they're not sure if the light will go out in the middle of the night. So we're providing energy reliability for, I mean, these target sectors, and of course, I mean, other SMEs, the small businesses um, across the country. We're starting out with Lagos and Abuja. I mean, we will expand to Port Harcourt before the end of the year, and of course, we will uh, we'll roll out across the country going forward. Also speaking, co founder of Energy, Kunle Odebumi, highlights the importance of alternative renewable energy in the Nigerian energy crisis. Energy is that vision of the future. Um, it is the vision that we want to see replicated across sub-Saharan Africa. Uh, we believe that the critical mass is here in Nigeria uh, for the company to achieve these goals and uh, we look forward uh, to continuing to support the company. Um, this company has what will be considered a dream team of investors. Um, obviously, we are very much happy to be joined in this round by North Fund. We are happy to be joined uh, by uh, EDFI, the Electrify Group, and we are happy to be joined by All On uh, uh, the Shell Group uh, to, as syndicate members of this round.